Hey guys, what's up? It's Claire and um, this week we're gonna go to Sofia in Bulgaria. Um, my friends over there, one of them, she's actually Bulgarian so she's probably gonna take us around, see some cool places. Our plan is to train to Eindhoven in the Netherlands today, which is Thursday, and then fly over there Friday morning. And then we would tr um, fly back into Charleroi in Brussels and then train back to Nice. But uh, our plan was kind of shooken up because um, on the way to Maastricht, which is where we're staying tonight, like some police guard dogs came in, like went sniffing around in our stuff to see if we had cannabis, um, just because like Amsterdam is really close by. So he just sat down and had this full conversation with us. And then basically he was like, oh, what's the next station? So we were like, all right, cool. And then I wasn't even paying attention, so I just walked off. And it turns out that is not Maastricht, where it's like this small city in Belgium. Not even sure what the name of it is. And then the next train comes in an hour, thankfully. But um, we're just walking around this cool little town. Actually quite nice. Um, but yeah, we're probably gonna get in around like 11. And then sleep for like a few hours, get up at 5.30 to catch the train. Um, to the airport so yeah i'm pretty sure it'll be really fun it's really really cold in bulgaria right now i think it's like 12 degrees at night um so i packed a bunch of warm clothes and then um yeah i think it'll be interesting and then obviously there's a lot of political instability in that area right now especially with what's happening with ukraine um I don't think there's any like issues going to Bulgaria right now. We might just encounter some protests, but other than that, we'll keep on an eye. But yeah, see you guys there.
what's up it's our second day in bulgaria um today we're just we took a bus um two and a half hours out of sofia and we're visiting a monastery here it's called Ria monastery um it's very nice very secluded it's on the mountainside so we got to see a lot of um peaks snowy snowy peaks up there for example i don't know if you can see that but they're all covered in snow. It's actually very cold. It's down to like 21 degrees. Um, but yeah, so basically this monastery isn't, is still active, but only like nine monks live here. So the rest of it is just for like tourists. Unfortunately, I don't know if I can take pictures inside, but there's a bunch of frescoes like on the outside of the walls. And each of them basically tell like a story. So basically these are like, depictions of the many trials that a soul has to go through after they've died and basically what I said was like for example the children on here they're all the same There's like this little like, there's like this little well where you can fill up um, your water bottle in. It's like minimal water. Um, and it's just like completely iced over. It's so cold here. <laughs> Hey guys, so Sunday morning. So last day in Sofia. Sad. Um, it's been quite a ride. We saw lots of stuff yesterday. Um, and we went to this techno club. Which is really, really... It, the decor was just like so different from any of the other ones that we went to in like Spain. <coughs> or like Portugal. Um, it was pretty nice though. But uh, this morning we were supposed to take a free walking tour but the guy didn't show up so we were like booking it for like a few like 30 minutes and then um, he didn't show up but it's all right we're just gonna do our own little soviet walking tour um but today's probably gonna be like one of the most stressful days of like traveling at least because we have to catch a plane at like 4 50 p.m to brussels <laughs> and then we gotta get through customs we gotta get on a bus in like 20 minutes after we board the plane and then we have to hope that the bus gets there on time for the train at 56, which is uh, Route 756. So um, after that, if we do manage to get on the train, we have three transfers, seven, nine, and five minutes. And then we'll get back to Metz at like 12.30. But also like there are no metros running anymore at that time. So we probably have to walk back to the dorm, but we'll see how that goes. It's gonna be fun. Not really, but. Thank you. 